let's start out with a little bit of functionality of what these things are and why the heck does this camshaft have all these lobes i mean this is one bank of the camshaft for three cylinders and it has 18 lobes why in god's name would this thing have 18 lobes well if you look down here going into the let's put it, let's put it the right way when we set it here you can see each lifter that would be down inside here is going to be contacted by three lobes you can see the contact surface on the lifter but it has two high and one low well this little magic lifter has the ability to either run on the low lobe or run on the high lobes using this little port applying pressure to it locks a pin in jams this thing together and when it's jammed together it will be pushed by the high lobes when there's no pressure here the high lobes can collapse and it's actuating the valve yes the valve would be pushing here so this low lift lobe which on a 996 is only three millimeters 997 turbo is four millimeters left so they change that around a little bit but again the thing will go from low lift actuation to high lift actuation with the ability of just putting a little pressure there that pressure comes from this little port down inside here that comes from this channel that comes from this hole that is actuated by this solenoid we've got a kind of a complex thing going on here this has nothing to do with the cam advance nothing to do with pinning cams this is high lift and low lift we're talking about here